All righty, I have a construction update for you guys today. So work has started in Extreme Sky Flyer's plot of land. As you can see here, they got the um, drill on site at Extreme Sky Flyer. They got the telecarrier and they got some rebar cages. Um, so they are 100% going to be working on that Extreme Sky Flyer element, um, similar to almost like a treble clef with an inversion. So uh, that's really cool. Um, as you can see here, they started really digging deep over in one specific section where a water main used to exist, um, but it was removed in the off season. So they've dug deep in there. Sorry, <laughs> I was holding in a cough and I was just sounding weird, so I'm just going to let it up. Um, but as you can see here, they uh, dug a little deeper and they're just um, tampering the, the soil there now, um, probably because they need that drill bit to be able to move over everything. So they're probably going to fill that back in and temper it down so it's not so loose because it's been exposed and flooded a lot this season. Um, but yeah, it's going to be really cool to see this project come to life. Um, so as of yesterday, uh, no track has been carried into the park. It is still sitting in the parking lot. The station area is still looking trackless um, and no sign of footing here. They buried it. Um, the one they had done. So that was interesting. Um, and a lot of the work has just come to a complete stop in this area. Now, what's even more interesting is this out of nowhere um, mark for removal on all the trees entering underneath Thunder Run's first turn in between Tiny Tom's and the Grab and Go building. So all these trees and lights have been marked for removal. And if you look closely, it's almost like a perfect path into that mountain. Now, if that transpires to actually end up being anything, um, who knows? But it is weird that those are marked for removal when they're not in the way or the path of the coaster at all. Um, it could end up being a theming piece. It could have to do with the queue line, which I don't think, by the way. I'm just listing all possibilities. But it is really interesting that this specific section has been marked for removal underneath Thunder Run. We do know that they have plans to move Thunder Run's exit, um, but I just don't see this being the location. It is way too far away, um, and that would have to go over the launch and tunnel um, for Elpen Fury. So I don't think this is, has to do with the exit for Thunder Run, um, but we do know there are going to be some modifications to that. So we'll keep an eye on it for you guys. Um, stay tuned. And obviously, if you don't, follow us on Patreon. Um, that's where we post a lot of our newsletters and soon-to-be um, regular drone updates for you guys. Anyways, thanks so much, guys. Have a good one. Bye.